I'm Dr. Peter McGovern, and I'm the medical director at uh, University of Reproductive Associates. What we do is uh, we individualize our patient care, and we focus on the entire patient, um, making sure that we're managing all of the problems, not just necessarily the most obvious problem. The best way to explain individualization of care, I believe, is to give you an example. Um, so a couple years ago, I saw a couple who had been to IVF centers around the world. They'd done three IVF cycles and uh, without success. And we discovered in our evaluation that the, the gentleman had um, a very early case of diabetes. Uh, we corrected his diabetes and they became pregnant on their first IVF cycle with us. Um, and uh, we didn't do anything different during the IVF cycle than anyone else had done. The only thing we did differently was really correct his other medical problems. So uh, that's how focusing on the entire couple can really make a big difference in the outcome. So uh, the patient experience at URA, um, it's, uh, we really have a team approach. Um, so once patients come in, um, we collect um, information from both partners. Um, and uh, then they see the physician first. Um, they have a comprehensive consultation. Um, and uh, after they're finished with the physician, they'll uh, always be exited by a nurse uh, who will review all their instructions. Uh, we have our laboratories on site. Uh, so that include, includes the andrology laboratory uh, that will assess the, uh, the male factor. We have a hormone assay laboratory and we have the embryology laboratory. Our team approach to IVF um, means that we get together on a weekly basis with uh, all of the physicians and all of our uh, laboratory scientists um, to go over each and every patient that's actually about to go through a cycle um, to make sure that um, we really have optimized everything in their care before the cycle. The philosophy of our, of our IVF program is to um, achieve superior pregnancy rates um, while keeping the multiple pregnancy rate as low as humanly possible. Um, and uh, there have been a lot of different advances over the years that we've incorporated to accomplish that feat successfully. So the complications that you may see with uh, multiple pregnancy, particularly with high order multiple pregnancy, so triplets or more, are really uh, premature birth. That's really the most dramatic one and the one that causes the most health problems. And when your babies are born at three pounds or two pounds instead of six or seven pounds, there are really a lot more both immediate and long-term health problems from that prematurity. So because of the seriousness of those problems, particularly for long-term implications for the baby, that's really why we pay so much care to uh, trying to keep that multiple pregnancy low at the same time that we keep our pregnancy rate very high.